Hello, my name is Taka. I have just embarked on a 45-day candida cleanse to finally rid my mind, body, and soul of what has felt like a prison for a very long time. I have just begun to take the candida wall suppressor treatment, and I am on the fifth day. And I have dealt with symptoms for a really long time, I would say since I was 16. Um, digestive issues and breakout skin, like small skin rashes, um, and a general feeling of being lethargic, like, like very tired, like very tired and very drained um, easily. I was, I guess, diagnosed with fibromyalgia, which is a autoimmune scenario where your muscles um, are in a constant like muscular inflammation and spasm and they can't really tell you where it comes from or there's no cure. What it really is, in my opinion, is a autoimmune um, trigger inflammation to um, something that is very aggravating to the system and in my case I really believe it is a reoccurring issue with candida. Um, I realized I was uh, allergic to gluten a couple years ago so I cut out all of my gluten products and um, I saw a increase in my energy but I was still dealing with some of these um, with some of the symptoms, um, reoccurring like kidney issues. And um, so now, since for the past two weeks, I have been preparing for the Candida cleanse to take the, the product. I have um, been doing an anti-Candida diet. So I've cut out all starches. And so I've cut out rice and I've cut out um, basically all grains. And um, all sugars except for a little bit of fruit sugar and I have noticed that well many things are going on but first and foremost I've noticed that the symptoms of the die out and the candida I've seen a spike in some of my health issues I'm also embarking on this journey right while I was in the middle of a full-blown kidney infection and about this close to going on antibiotics for like the 20th time. And then I had the incredible privilege of being introduced to this product through a dear friend of mine, Patty Universe, and she said, are you ready to feel in full health in your body, to know what that feels like in this life? And I said, yes. <laughs> so here we are on day five of the cleanse, and I have noticed very strange things popping in my ear, an itching in my skin, um, this buzzing sound, like um, it's almost as if there's like a battle going on inside and my immune system is um, finally taking charge over the candida. And I feel like the fog and the veil is going to be lifted in my life and I realize that candida is a sneaky one and persistent and in a small balance, in small amounts, it's a balance for all of us. But for many of us who are eating lots of starchy things in our diets, we've just kind of grown up eating sugary um, bread, <laughs> basically, and uh, have fed the candida to the point that I feel like depression and... Um, gosh, even like on the subtle levels of complacency in my life or having cravings for things that I know are not good for me. And um, so I'm really excited to take control back in my life and I'm watching how this cleanse is affecting so many levels of my being. Um, even though I'm not feeling very well right now in my body, I know that there is a horizon ahead where I'm going to feel great and I'm really looking forward 
to reporting on the end of this 45 days how I feel and keeping it up with a conscious diet. So thank you for joining me on this journey and I have to say that this is my first video blog and I've had um, a couple days where I haven't felt so great so it's been hard to get on but I've made a new promise to get on and say hi and give you a check-in even when I'm not feeling good, especially when I'm not feeling good. So thank you for being here. Bye.